Welcome to video log number one. Um, if you please check the journey. Today we are in beautiful Port Jefferson, Long Island, New York. You didn't know that New York had stuff like this. Look, we're in back, we got the pole trees in the street. And if you turn the camera around, you can see it's a beautiful little port town. Hello and welcome to more please vlog number two. Back in 1505, the Comanche tribe built this house behind me to celebrate their victory of the Battle of New York. Um, we're on day three of uh, drum tracking and it's going very well. By now, you know, it's Billy Reimer from Dillinger Escape Plan who's playing the drums. He was kind enough to say yes when we asked him to play drums and now he's playing drums somewhere up there on a hill. Somewhere up there. We are tasting freedom food in our freedom time here in Freedom Land. We've had freedom pancakes, we have freedom enchiladas, and I've got not Coca Cola but uh, cane cola. I'm excited about that. And uh, yeah, that's what's happening. Have a good day. Welcome to the third uh, video log from our drum recording sessions in Voodoo Studios in Nork. Uh, Billy Reimer is right now currently getting his uh, hair surgically removed uh, to increase aerospace dynamic flow while playing drums. So we're waiting for him right now. Uh, this is the studio. They got all the, the equipment. They've got the, the Heifer 210. It's got a great uh, compression. Uh, the Mark II heifer, slightly better. They got the the EQs, the the Stanley Stanley EQs, uh, first made by a Stanley man in '72. Uh, it wasn't popular at the time, but it had a resurgence in the '90s when people got tired of digital recording. They got the typical APA lunchbox, you know that, computer screen, beautiful sliders, and everything you might need to create good drum tracks. Uh, so that's what we're doing. Uh, we'll show you some uh, clips of that now. Wow, what a guy. And uh, yeah, so we're, we're, we'll be done after the day that we're gonna try to get back to Norway. There's a storm coming, they gave it a name. It was uh, uh, T-Pain, uh, T-Pain's coming. Uh, so we might actually be stranded for Christmas in uh, in Port Jefferson, which will be exciting, maybe a little bit sad, uh, but yeah, it's going great, and uh, hope you're having a wonderful holiday time. Hallelujah.